This is his code. Code? What kind of killer is he? He belongs to an ancient Chinese warrior cult called the Sons of the Dragons. He is their executioner. A single man. Very powerful. They need no other. Christ. Sounds like a fucking video game. Next thing we'll be playing Dungeons and Dragons. No, uh -uh. Attack of the Yakuza killers from Mars. No, it's a real bestseller. My kid's got it. Okay, <laughs> come on, come on. Mr. Shimazaki doesn't joke, gentlemen. The roots of the Sons of the Dragons are very old and run very deep. Fourteen centuries ago, the Manchus overthrew the Chinese emperor and instituted the reign of terror. The 108 militant Buddhist monks mounted a revolt. The Manchus destroyed all but five of the monks. These five founded the Society of the Sons of the Dragons. They became the guardian of the Chinese people struggling against injustice and oppression. They have one killer, the Freeman. Legend has it that the dragon breathes within this man, that he cannot die. His bodies change. He could be Chinese, American, Japanese, any color, any race. But he is always the dragon, always the same man, a super killer. Part fact, part wishful thinking, who knows? The sons of the dragons exist. So does the Freeman. They are fanatics, criminals. You have 48 hours to find him. After that, well, you have been warned. 